Diane Divers Blair was born October 25, 1938 in Washington, D.C. The daughter of two attorneys, she graduated cum laude from Cornell University's Department of Government in 1959. Blair served as an analyst for the President's Committee on Government Contracts, conducted research for the Senate Special Committee on Unemployment, and served as a legislative assistant and speechwriter to U.S. Senator Stuart Symington of Missouri. In 1963, she wed Arkansan Hugh Kincaid and moved to Fayetteville, where she completed her master's degree at the University of Arkansas in 1967. In 1971, Blair was appointed to chair the Governor's Commission on the Status of Women by Governor Dale Bumpers. Then, upon her decided victory in a debate in favor of the Equal Rights Amendment in 1975, she was selected to chair a commission on public employee rights by Governor David Pryor. In 1979, after her marriage ended, she wed Jim James Burton Blair, a ceremony performed by Governor Bill Clinton. Clinton also appointed her to the Commission for the Arkansas Educational Television Network from 1980 to 1993, where she served as chairperson in 1986 and 1987. In 1982, Blair won the J. William Fulbright College of Arts and Sciences Master Teacher Award in Politics. Her first book, Silent Hattie Speaks, the personal journal of Senator Hattie Carraway, was based on the journals of the first woman to be elected U.S. Senator. Her second book, Arkansas Politics and Government, Do the People Rule, was published in 1988. This work now serves as a textbook in many universities. In 1992 and 1996, Blair served as an advisor on the Clinton-Gore presidential campaigns and chronicled the 1992 campaign as official historian. She was also selected to be a member of the Arkansas delegation to the Electoral College. She followed the campaign again in 1996, keeping journals and conducting interviews on the team's perception of the campaign. Those papers were donated to the special collections of the U of A libraries. Clinton appointed Blair to the board of directors of the U.S. Corporation for Public Broadcasting, where she served from 1993 to 2000. She became chair, and the boardroom was later named in her honor. Blair died in 2000 of lung cancer. Her husband bestowed an endowment to the Fayetteville Public Library in her honor and also endowed the Diane Blair Chair of Political Science at the U of A. The Diane D. Blair Center of Southern Politics and Society at the University of Arkansas was established with funds appropriated from Congress in 2000. As an educator, public servant, political scientist, and writer, Blair was frequently voted a favorite professor at the University of Arkansas at Fayetteville.